Welcome back. Healthcare disparities in Cuyahoga County have long been an issue. In fact, data from 2019 before the pandemic shows that how long you live can vary widely based on your zip code. In some inner city Cleveland neighborhoods, life expectancy among residents is 23 years less than their suburban counterparts. And the impact of the pandemic is not known just yet. I spoke with a local doctor who has made it his mission to fix that problem as part of our ongoing A Turning Point series. You know, the, the health care disparities that we see in the data when you compare African-American health outcomes to the majority population are dramatic. And to the extent, I, I call it a national crisis. Dr. Charles Modlin is Metro Health's first medical director of inclusion, diversity and equity, a position that was created last year and he's made it his focus to address the lack of medical care that plagues some communities. Both here in Northeast Ohio and across the country, the impacts are wide ranging and include higher rates of high blood pressure, diabetes, heart disease, and cancer among minority groups, but especially those in the black community. For example, black men develop and die from prostate cancer at twice the rate of their white counterparts. Black men have about a four to six shorter year life expectancy compared to white men. It's a huge crisis. Dr. Modlin saw that crisis and came up with his own solution by launching the Minority Men's Health Fair. It's an event that had taken place every year since 2003, up until the pandemic, growing each time. Over the years, you know, the health fair grew dramatically to where we had, you know, 1,500, 1,800 men coming in every year to undergo these free preventative health screenings. This April, Dr. Modlin is bringing the event back in his new role at Metro. We call it the Minority Men's Health Fair, but in reality, it's open to everybody, regardless of race, ethnicity, gender, uh, because we're all inclusive. Uh, but we're offering free preventative health screenings, health education, physical examinations. In our communities, black men oftentimes, we don't go to the doctor until it's too late. Marcus Patton knows the importance of getting preventative medical care. It was at the Minority Men's Health Fair that he was diagnosed with diabetes, and he had no idea he had it. Because oftentimes, like I said, we don't eat right. You know, oftentimes, eat too much greasy foods, all that stuff. And it weighs heavily on our, on our bodies. We don't get enough exercise. And like I said, diabetes is rampant in our community. And oftentimes, we don't even know that we're diabetic. Now, Patton has made it his mission to spread the word. I would tell them that life is on the line. You know what I'm saying? If they care about themselves and their families, it's incumbent upon them to annually get, get checked out. Go get a checkup. Go get a simple checkup. And as for Dr. Modlin, he continues his mission of making the medical profession more equitable and reducing the disparities affecting communities of color.